Hi guys, so some time ago, uh, I found these two rocks, um, rock hunting on beaches in Northern California. And um, I did talk about them. If you go back and look at some previous videos, you might uh, be able to find when I mentioned them. So this was from an earlier rock hunting trip. And uh, it's an interesting conglomerate. And uh, somebody commented, that they would like to see this rock, uh, this rock polished. So I, I went ahead and polished it. I couldn't put it in a tumbler because of these uh, these holes in the uh, in end here. But um, I polished it on my flat lap and this is how, I didn't do all the surfaces. I just wanted to see how it looks like with some parts polished. So this is how it looks like. You can see this polished area here. It's uh, It does polish up nicely. Um, and it makes the uh, the inclusions uh, pop and much better contrasted. So that's very nice. I hope that maybe in future I'll be able to find another rock that's like this that doesn't have holes like this that I can actually put into a tumbler so I can get the whole thing polished. Yeah, so that's that rock. And this rock, it's uh, actually like a dark bluish um, agate with inclusions. At first, I wasn't sure what the inclusions were. Um, <clears throat> but so I decided to give it a polish. Uh, so th this area here has been polished somewhat. And you might be able to see that these uh, there are these specks of uh, uh, metallic flakes. They're actually gold colored. So I think um, these are pyrite inclusions. Yeah, it's very interesting. So it appears that the, the dark stuff running all throughout this agate is uh, pyrite. I think it's pyrite. And uh, that's what makes it look dark. And the agate is somehow like bluish, I think. It's a bluish agate. This is another area that's uh, polished. You can see um, this bigger Sorry, this bigger flake here, it's a gold colored. I don't think it's gold, or maybe it's gold, I don't know. If you know what this is, maybe leave it in the comment. Leave a comment, in the, <laughs> leave a comment below. Um, but yeah, it's very cool. I've never found an agate like this before. I'm not sure if I should cut it open. You can see the uh, nice uh, fortifications here. I'm not sure how it'll look like if I cut it open. Maybe I should, and then um, polish both halves. Maybe it'll reveal more, uh, more of its structure and more, uh, more of what the inclusions actually look like. Let me know in the comments what you think I should do with this. All right. I hope you enjoyed this uh, short video.